No foundation, no concealer, nothing on my face. The only thing that you're seeing for the shading is how I've used the tanning drops to create this shading and contouring this natural, very natural look, which is what Ellie Glow is all about. The bottom line is, how did I actually achieve this look? Let's go back and find out. Good morning. I wanted to show you the results from yesterday. This is about, uh, about 22 hours later. Um, you can see the, um, the progress that I've had on my skin with the tanning drops. It looks really, really great. Today I'm going to do a little bit of contouring up here in my eyes because I don't, I'm not wearing makeup right now. Um, but I want to give a little bit of definition because I don't like a lot of makeup. Typically I wear it every day, but I don't like a lot of it. Um, and I do like the option of contouring um, that little crease area with tanning drops, which is really nice and it looks great and adds a little bit of definition and ease for the, the eye makeup that does come off my eyeshadow. Most important, I wanted to show you the Rapid and the results on the Rapid. They remember I had those uh, white tan lines right here from, from golfing. And look, look at the evening out. That is just awesome and great. So that was about four hours worth of uh, processing. And today I have, of course, showered, and that is the base color that you're seeing from Ellie Glow Light to Medium on my skin, processing for four hours and then washing it off, and that is the day after. So you can see that it is a very natural looking tan. I did not use any Ellie Glow on purpose on my arms, and you can see the coloration just blends in beautifully, which is what Ellie Glow does. It looks natural, it blends in with your natural skin tone, it's rich with the oils, Baobab, Marula, uh, and of course our signature Kalahari melon seed oil, which is so lubricating, so hydrating, and, and also anti-aging. So I just wanted to show you what it looks like the next day. Uh, now what I'm going to do is uh, cut this video short and do the next on contouring. Hi, just a quick video and showing you how to contour the eye area. I used Ellie Glow yesterday, so what I'm doing is kind of layering up my look and that'll hold for at least, you know, five to seven days using my tan extender, uh, which I do use actually on my face as well. Uh, but today I'm going to be using the eye drops right in my crease area. I don't have any makeup on it at the moment. And the first thing that you want to do is prepare the skin for the tanning drops. So what you want to do is you want to take the AHA prepping toner, which has uh, pomegranate and uh, it's just wonderful and lemongrass. So first thing I always do is I always smell it. It smells delicious. So what I'm doing is prepping that area very nicely and here we go. And just waiting for that to dry. Prepping the area. There we go. And what we're going to do is use the tanning drops au natural with no mixing of serum this time for the actual um, crease area. So we're going to use very, very, very little. And I'm actually going to put it directly onto just a regular makeup brush. So I'm going to drop that on there and soak the makeup brush, the tanning drops. And I'm going to very gently go in to my crease area. And I like it to come down just a little bit. I do keep it away from the actual lash line, but just like you were putting on eye makeup. There we go. Other side. Over here. Blending in. And that's a nice little contour that I'll get thinner towards the center and then contouring to make sure that I've got definition into that crease and just blending a little bit, blending a little bit and this will take about well, approximately eight hours, six to eight hours to fully process but we'll get results in about an hour. There we 
go. Well, it's just going to be a really nice look. So when you wake up in the morning, you'll already have a beautifully defined crease area. And what it does is when you put tanning drops inside this area, it really highlights your natural brow because you've got a color definition and variance between the two, just like you're wearing um, makeup all the time. So I'll be back in a little while and show you how it processes in, a, in another hour. Hey, here I am again, and what we're going to do right now is teach you how to contour your nose area. Um, if you want to stream me on your nose, I've got a little bit of all on my nose, so if you see naturally in the light, you want to contour where the light naturally shades, which is down this area here, so that when you don't have a direct light on like I have right now, you're still getting the slimming effect of the shadowing that you're creating. We're going to use Ellie Glow Drops, of course. And they're just great. I've, I've done my base color of Ellie Glow Drops yesterday, and today I'm contouring the area. I've already done my eyes, so you can watch that video. And now I'm doing the nasal contouring. So what you do is you just take a, a regular brush. I use a brush like this. You just put a little bit of drops on there, about two or three drops. And what I do is I just go and shade this area right here. There we go. Same on the other side. Streamlining down. Streamlining down. Into that area right there. And then nicely blending to make sure that that is just sun kissed. You don't want a line. There we go. Just dabbing nicely. Dabbing nicely, and then I go underneath my nose as well, just to streamline that area as well, because that's a natural shade area. There we go. And voila, I have applied my contouring. So we've got our eyes, we have our nose area, which is going to look great in just about an hour. It takes about six hours to eight hours to fully process, but you'll get results within about 60 to 90 minutes. Um, I'm going to hit this with a hairdryer right now so that I accelerate it so you can see uh, how quickly this actually develops, but uh, I love my Ellie Glow. Bye. I'm back. It's been about 90 minutes since I used the tanning drops to contour my face. So I want to show you the results thus far. Here in the nose area, you can see that contouring. And the effect of that contouring is that streamlining of the nose, which is great. No foundation, no concealer, nothing on my face. The only thing that you're seeing for the shading is how I've used the tanning drops to create this shading and contouring, this natural, very natural look, which is what Ellie Glow is all about. I don't like to use you know, concealers and foundations and that type of stuff. Um, especially in the heat, it's about 33 degrees today. It's just going to wash off my face anyway when I sweat, and this won't. So you'll see the contouring in here, contouring underneath. See that area right there is darker. This area is lighter, creating that streamlined look, which I need because my nose is a little bit wider here. And then I've contoured in there, remember, in here and then down. This is a processing time of about 90 minutes. It will continue to process over the next six to eight hours. The tanning drops are a full 30% DHA. So this is a really intensely concentrated product. I only used three or four drops to create this on a little brush, as you remember, and this is the result after 90 minutes. The thing about Ellie Glow Cosmetics and skincare and tanning products is we really want your skin to be naturally glowing, to look its best, and this is what happens when you use the My Face Deserves It All with the tanning drops. And again, that beautiful countenance that we got over here and complexion that we got over here from the Rapid when I had those big white tan lines yesterday. So this is what we're all about. I'll check in with you in a little while.
in about 90 more minutes. So I'm back and I just looked at the results so far. So you can see that the tanning drops have been on my face at a few, good few hours now. It's another 90 minutes. We're at about the three hour mark. And you can see the deepening of color and shading and contouring, which is really awesome. So I'm getting exactly the result that I wanted. So I have my lightness here and I have my lightness down the bridge of my nose my contouring and shading that I put with my Ellie Road dots earlier today, about three hours, here and here. And then in my eye area, you see the contouring right there. There we go. You can see it quite a bit closer. Shading there, shading there. It looks great. So I'm super happy with the results thus far. Really, really, really stoked. So I'll see you in another couple of hours. So here I am with the final check-in. Um, we processed for about four and a half hours right now. You can see the sculpting is really defined now. Um, it's super, super awesome. My eyes, you can see that shading up into there and then down slightly. Again, here, very natural kind of shading along my nose area. Super, super nice. Nice shading. And then what I wanted was I wanted that definition down my nose that sculpting down my nose, kind of narrow the nose and make it uh, a bit more streamlined. So that's what it looks like. Super, super happy. That's what we want at Ellie Glow. I don't like a lot of foundation, a lot of concealer or anything like that. So by using the My Face Deserves It All with the tanning drops uh, mixed in with the serum, this is the result that you get. So I'm really, really super stoked about this. It turned out great as it usually does. I'll talk to you later. Hey, so I've done the contouring of my eyes. I've done the contouring of my nose just a little while ago, and now it's time to actually do my lily white legs. So um, the first thing I did already in the shower, and I'm gonna show you how to use it, is I used our uh, Ellie Glow Rich Walnut. Oh, that smells so good. You know, the smells are all from our essential oils and the, and the ingredients that we put in them. But every time I open up the jar, I just go, wow, that is just so wonderful. It smells great. Um, now, you'll notice that the grains inside of here are quite dark. And one of the most interesting things about this particular scrub is that it is designed to foam and also react with the, um, the cellular glue that binds the skin cells together. So it does a little bit of melting in there. It's got a little bit of acid base. That smells so good. Uh, one of the things that you'll also notice is that you use very, very, very little of the product, like all of our products, to, to make a, a big difference in the actual exfoliation that happens on your skin. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna kind of show you how to use it. What I suggest is that you don't use it like a, other scrubs. Um, it's very, very different. You damp your skin. So you're just gonna put a tiny little bit of water on your skin like that. And you're going to put a very minuscule amount of scrub, tiny like that. So you can use a teaspoonful for your whole legs, and your arms. And as you're scrubbing, what happens is it actually starts foaming. See that? Now what you're going to do is you're going to kind of keep on exfoliating very gently. And you'll notice that... The beads actually don't go away like a salt scrub does. You know how it disintegrates in a salt scrub, so you use a lot of product with a salt scrub, and I've never liked that. With the walnut, the pulverized walnut, the crushed walnut scrub, um, the grains are very minuscule, so we don't get any derm abrasions, which is a problem with any nut scrubs. We've made them very fine powder, but what it does is it actually goes in and exfoliates, and that's all you do. And you can add a little bit more water if it gets too dry, and it'll just foam up again, which is great. So you can keep on, there we go. There you go, and you can feel that lubrication and scrubbing action happen. So it doesn't disintegrate, it doesn't go away. That's why you can spend uh, a lot less money with an Ellie Glow product, because it doesn't go away, it doesn't disintegrate, it doesn't dissolve. So you can keep on using that tiny, tiny little bit. In fact, that would be enough for my whole arm using this product. So I'll just go down to just a little bit. So anyway, that's how you use the walnut exfoliator. Then you rinse it off. 
And I do suggest that you prep the skin with a toner before you use any of the products because that'll set your DHA up a little bit better. If you've got a, um, an acidic balance to your skin, it works out a lot better and the results are optimal. So I'm gonna go out to the pool and show you how to put on the Rapid Moves.